All aboard Bookworm Express, young readers. My name's Stacy, and today we are reading Veggie Tales Time for Tom by Phil Vischer. This is one of my aunt's favorite cartoons, so I'm kind of looking forward to it. I hope you enjoy it. Bob and Larry are here today to stage for you a little play. So call your dad and get your mom. It's time to start. It's time for Tom. It's time for Tom to rise and shine. The sun is up. He's feeling fine. The bus will come at five till nine. It's time for Tom to rise and shine. The clock reads eight o'clock a.m. because he's getting up. It's time for Tom to make his bed and fluff the pillow that holds his head and smooth the sheet with a nice blue thread. It's time for Tom to make his bed. Nine o'clock reads 8.30 in the morning. It's time for Tom to go to school and learn about the golden rule and sit at his desk on a tiny stool. It's time for Tom to go to school. Now the clock reads nine o'clock. They wrote it on the board there. See? Hmm. It's time for Tom to eat his lunch with Laura and Junior, his favorite bunch. With things to drink and things to munch, it's time for Tom to eat his lunch. Now both hands are at the 12, which makes it 12 o'clock, or as we call it noon. That is lunch time. It's time for Tom to play outside, to run and jump and swing and slide. With places for Junior and Laura to hide, it's time for Tom to play outside. Now the little hand is at two and the long hand is at 12, making it two o'clock in the afternoon. It's time for Tom to eat again with Ma and Pa. They sit and then thank God for their food with a big amen. It's time for Tom to eat again. All right, now the little hand is at the six, the long hand's at the 12 again, but now it's late at night, so it's 6 o'clock p.m. Anything afternoon is um, is going to be p.m. It's time for Tom to hit the tub. From head to toe, he needs a scrub. So get the soap and start to rub. It's time for Tom to hit the tub. All right, now the short hand's at the seven, long hand's at the 12, so it's seven o'clock. It's time for Tom to go to bed. He's feeling tired, his eyes are red. He puts his nightcap on his head. It's time for Tom to go to bed. My low hand is at the eight, long hand is at 12, so 8 o'clock p.m. It's time for Tom to say his prayers. He's thankful for a God who cares, who fills us up with the love he shares. It's time for Tom to say his prayers. All right, 8 o'clock. It's time for Tom to say good night. Pa tucks him in, turns out the light. He'll start again when the sun is bright. It's time for Tom to say good night. Still eight o'clock. It's 
And that's it. That's the end of this one. Hope you enjoyed it. And practice telling your time if you don't know how to yet. Like, share, subscribe.